Jack here, owner of Hockey Alley, bringing you back hockey history and stick status. Today I got the Tron Basic Pro Flex. This used to be a one piece, it's been broken, and I just kept the shaft. So I do collect hockey shafts, and this one was one of the collection, but it was a one piece originally, uh, made in China. And uh, Tron had an unusual amount of selection which was not consistent. Um, they had a little bit of everything. Uh, top end sticks, low end sticks, uh, just hard to keep up with them because they just colored certain colors on one stick. Another time you'd see the same, it was a different logo and design. And there's no flex rating on this. There's a, right there, C8, that could be the pattern of the stick. And it's pretty heavy. I bet you this is not even graphite. This is probably a composite. Has a 30-day warranty on it. Uh, this one, I have no idea what it retailed for. But I could tell you that I had a student of mine who bought six Tron sticks for $9 a piece. Brand new senior one-piece sticks. Nine bucks a piece. I thought that was a great deal. No matter what the stick is, nine bucks. Brand new. You cannot go wrong especially for a composite of any kind. So um, yeah, they're not high end. I never saw anybody in the NHL using Tron. I have seen, uh, I think other products of Tron, but I don't even know if they're still around or not. So I'm not sure about the company too much. I've never used one. Uh, yeah, so it's very uh, different, uh, like logo design. Like than others, the the font and the lettering is very different than any other company. Uh, colors are green, white, and uh, yellow basic color right there. That's about it, but it's pretty heavy. So the Tron that the $9 sticks also, those were pretty heavy. They weren't light, but it didn't matter, nine bucks though. <laughs> Yeah, so this is all I know about Tron. Thank you for watching my video.